Well, first of all, just to clar clarify something, to, to, under, uh, to let your, your viewers understand the difference. Although they, they go through various sittings in Parliament and they put forward legislation which is proposed, and it goes through various sittings in both houses and then gets royal assent, even if that's the case, it doesn't mean that it's law. For it to become law, the people have to consent. So if you uh, believe that you're a living man or woman, you actually have a choice. It says the government and the state will actually say that they govern by consent. The police say that they police by consent. Now, what that means is that as, as a living man or woman, if you do not consent, it's not law. So this COVID legislation and any other legislation they have, when they take it out, it only becomes a law with your consent. So with you consenting to the legislation, it then carries the full force of law. If you do not consent, it's not law and they cannot enforce it. So when the police approach you and say, look, you're required to wear a mask, no, you're not, because there's no law. And if they refer you to statutory legislation, that is only applicable to the person, which is a contractual agreement, the legal entity. You state, no, I'm sorry, I do not stand under your authority. I don't consent, I'm a living man or a living woman, it doesn't apply to me. Where, and then you can't say to them, well, where is the law that states I as a living man have to wear a mask? There's not a law. They'll refer you to a statutory act of parliament, and they'll say according to this legislation, and they'll give you the, the definition, the number and the statute. You say, well, that's fine, but it's not applicable to me as a living man, which it's not. It's applicable to the legal entity which they created at birth, which is a legal fiction. And if they can get joined up and trick you into accepting the position of the legal fiction, you're then bound by their rules. As long as you're careful with what you do, do not get involved with them and try not to talk too much. If, they, if you get into a detailed conversation with them, they will trick you and they will try to establish join up. The less you say, the better. The basic principles are, Confirm those, excuse me, can you confirm what law states I have to wear a mask? Ask them if that's a question. If they, if they reply with legislation, they say, I'm sorry, it's not applicable to a living man. I stand under common law. I do not stand under your authority and I do not consent. And that's it. And if they say anything else, they say, sorry, I do not answer questions. And that's it. Leave it. Say nothing else. They cannot do anything to you because they have not established joiner in a contract 